Okay, today we are going to talk a little bit about MATLAB. My name is Corey. I'm just going to show you kind of some of the basics to MATLAB, then show you some work that I've done in the past that's pretty interesting. And uh, just to put this little input in, this video is brought to you by Camtasia, a very expensive screencasting software that you can buy for free. Uh, so let's go ahead and get started. Tell you a little bit about MATLAB. Um, this is the newest 2014 version, so it's a little different than the older versions that um, you might have seen in the past. You still have your workspace and command windows um, and your command history. You can rearrange the windows and do a whole bunch of different uh, setups with the new version. One thing I do like is the editorial. Um, the editor is right in the center, so you can like work cleanly off of that. You don't have different pop-ups or anything. So just to kind of show you a couple features here, let's go ahead and uh, assign x equals 2. Now as you notice, when you type this in, this also comes over here to the workspace, and it assigns x as a value of 2. And then let's go ahead and do y equals 2 also. And so now you can see that in your command window, when you assign y equals 2, it will show that y equals the value 2, and in your workspace, um, y shows that it has a value of 2. And so like you can do nice simple calculations pretty easy. Something like um, x plus 2 and you'll get x equals, uh, you'll get 4. And you can do stuff like x plus y and you also get 4. Um, this is the command one that's real nice if you need to do like quick entries but everybody has a calculator in their phone nowadays, so like, um, like it's really like no point. And like one of the like hard things is you can't scroll back up to edit any of this stuff. It's all locked. While you can scroll up to get to like your past entries, if you needed to like change something that you typed in wrong, you can't go back and edit. That's why the editor is such a nice feature. You can do the same thing. You can assign. Uh, variables and values y equals 2 there we go and then you can also just clearly type x plus y and then you'll come up here to the run button and you'll click run and then down in here in the command window you'll see that your answer equals 4 and let's say um, like you wanted to assign y equals 3 or 4 and you can hit run and then it'll come down here with the answer uh... that's the cool thing about editor you can go through and you can change your uh, work unlike the command window for this video it's just kind of a little intro thing but um... i hope you guys enjoyed it uh... check out my youtube page um... i'll see you guys next time